So we used a lot of windlasses on all the cranes, and uh, now we're finally going to learn how a windlass works. Yep. So we've got a load of, let's say, 50 pounds, and a lever, uh, let's see, the lever is about 36 inches long, and the pivot point is in the middle. 18 inches, 18 inches. So if you're lifting up 50 pounds, how much muscle do you need? 50 pounds. Okay, mechanical advantage of one, which means no real advantage. Correct. Now, okay. if we just move the pivot point. Now it's nine inches here to here, 27 from the pivot point to where I'm exerting the force. So this is a mechanical advantage of three. So if this is 50 pounds, somewhere around 16, 17 16 pounds. 16 pounds of muscle. Much easier. Well, what's the trade-off? Well, because it, since that uh, it's a third of the force required, I also have to move the end of this three times as far. Right. Okay. To lift it the same height. Gotcha. Okay, so, what's the next one? Let's move it once more. There we go. Now it's two inches to 34. 34. Yep, so two inches over here to 34 to where I'm exerting the force. Now we measure from the, the, the pivot point, which is the center of the pipe. Yep. That, now you got a mechanical advantage of 17. So if this was 50 pounds, I only have to use a little under three pounds of force. But? But I have to move it 17 times as far to, to lift at the same height. Yep. Okay, now let's go to the next one. 